I, I'm sorry, Catherine. I think I'm gonna have to put you on the naughty bench. Entering combat. You've been doing real good so far this match, and then you just you let me down right now. Now. Entering combat. I'm just gonna use all of this on murdering that. Like, all of this turn is... Really? They've missed one fucking Entering shot and you combat. miss? No, that's it. Edelweiss, you're in the naughty corner as well. Nature. Now. Just stay calm and get it done. <laughs> Entering combat. Well, I guess no one hits this round. <laughs> Jesus Christ. There we go. Fuck me. Oh. It's, it is even more snipers. Underminer fire. <laughs> Run away! Yeah, they'll, they'll probably successfully down both of them, but they have no way of actually getting to them, so I'm not overly worried. And it'll be, uh, I, 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 I don't know, good training. I get, yeah, training. <laughs> Here we go. Hostile sighted. Enemy sighted. Oh my god, I nearly walked into a fucking mine again. Target sighted. Enemy sighted. Now. Hm. Who are these guys? Okay, I need to move Nadine up, because I need to keep this boy bed and watered. Okay, okay, okay. Thank you. You stay right there, even though that's probably not gonna spot not a good spot for you. Okay, let's see if Catherine wants to uh wants to redeem herself here. So far, so good. She doesn't actually need headshots, which is probably one of the upsides at the moment. Goodbye. See, just, just when I start praising you, Catherine. I'm in 
impressed, but not surprised. My turn, okay? Come on, pull it together. Please hit. <laughs> Okay. Okay, we're now on turn 10. Jesus. I'm expecting the grade D minus from this mission. <laughs> yep, more reinforcements. Damage Ow. Ow. So she's gonna. Oh, thank fuck. Uh? Oh, thank fuck. He's not on a lot of health, but she's still on health, which is the main, the main thing here. Entering combat. Especially since now that this is gone, I can switch to this. And go, you fuck off. My turn, okay? Man down, everybody be careful. Keep an eye on your rear. Entering combat. Try how close I can get this. Now. Pretty close. But did that play out still to them? Excellent, it did. Moving out. Go and thank this person for shooting us last turn. Excellent. But not and there we go. Took us half the time, but... Or half the total time, I should say, but... Eh. Operation complete. Well, <laughs> I was correct about the D part, at least. <laughs> New episode has been added. Let's go. Desert Ruins. Huh? What's this supposed to be anyway? What a weird place for something like this. There you all are. Hey there, Faldio. I didn't know you were out here too. I'm an Who's the rat's gonna be out remember? here? I was ordered to observe the ruin's interior. The shape of it really is unusual. I've never seen anything like it. I feel like I've seen it before somewhere. Hmm. Where could it have been? This building was supposedly erected millennia ago by the Valkyrie themselves. So they actually existed then? Yes. The Valkyrie make a sudden appearance in European history thousands of years ago. Records say they brought with them incredibly advanced technology and divine might. Then one day, their history just ends. The Valkyrie just disappeared. I always thought they were just a myth. That's it. I remember now. Remember what, Welkin? What are you shouting about? This looks like an animal I found once. The Dread Nautilus. This structure looks just like a Dread Nautilus. A Dread Nautilus? You don't know? They're marine cephalopods. They live inside pointy spiral shells. <laughs> and these ruins look just like that shell. 
I wonder if there's some connection there. Welkin, you can be such a... Hmm? What's up? Nothing. Forget it. Right. Let's take a look inside, then. We may find some clue to why the Empire is out here. Alicia, I want you to come help Faldio and me look around inside. Largo, Rosie, and Isara, you stay here. Be on the lookout for movement in the area. All right, sir. Please be careful. Let us continue with more story. More! More story! Tell me, Silvaria, do these walls offer an answer to our search? If the search is, am I a douchebag? I'm sorry, buddy. I'm afraid the answer is yes. I pray, where sleeps the ancient power? What do you read, child? It, it's just, just memes and shitposting, sir. Valkov, the holy lance, scorcher of the vast earth, asleep eternal in the bosom of Rand Reese. Made pillar of its keeper's keep, kept thereby for eon without end. It's part of that stupid fucking tower, isn't it? Then it's true. The sacred lance lies buried within Ron Grease's walls. But your grace, how do you intend to control the lance once it is found? I don't know, I'll just jiggle it around a little, see what happens. <laughs> Worry not. A beast fit to bear that burden will soon be at our disposal. With this, our dream is made hard fact. Our crown shadow will extend to all of Europa. That's a really fucking big crown. I... That... I just... I can't help but think that would be impractical, both... For, for construction purposes, but also for, like... Actual purposes, you know? Chapter 7. The Battle at Barius. We got through an entire chapter, Pog! Episode has been added, personal tab has been updated, glossary tab has been updated, new skirmish battle has been added. Ah, no, 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 tab select. <laughs> Sara. Uh, taking an engineering in her father's footsteps, she elected a... Mechanics path in secondary military education, earning several credentials before enlisting. Reese. Uh, called to enlist while working a factory job in his hometown after middle school. He was initially so homesick, he reports once attempting to go AWOL to return. Leon. Despite entering a secondary tech school with promising grades, his free willing nature soon prompted him to withdraw and wander Gallia until war broke out. Cool. Uh, oh, no, 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 no. Uh, there we go. Yes, go back to headquarters. Let's see, let's see what else we got. Troopers first, and then yeah, fucking engineer, I guess. Fight! Fight the bullet! Good! Okay. All units defend. Excellent. Go. Okay. Anything what? else to upgrade here? Develop weapons. Rifles. It keeps saying accuracy boost, but the aim is still C. I don't get it. Oh. Ho ho ho. Like, I, I still want it, but... Oh. 
Nothing there yet, nothing there yet. Accuracy boost 3, which... Born upgrade 3, which is, once again, just more defense. But making it harder to kill literally all of your units is always going to be a plus for me. Body enhancements. Okay, they didn't add anything new here. What about the other ones? Treads. Still nothing major there. Oh, side upgrade too. Come okay. We're good for the moment. <laughs> Whoa. I don't know what I expected, but it really wasn't this. Door? Amazing, isn't it? I was surprised when I first came here, too. There aren't any windows or skylights in here, but it's still so light. The ruins are made of stone with a high ragnite concentration. It lights itself. Like, radiation? <laughs> it's uncanny. Radioactive! Radioactive! Look at this. Something's written on the wall here. LOL. Welkin sucks. 460, 920. There we go. It's Easy. Old Northern script. Old Northern, okay. Old Northern? It was the dominant writing system in Europa. You still see it on a lot of old monuments. Do you know how to read it, Faldio? Of course! Yeah, we just covered it this last year. Let's take a look. It's more or less a recounting of the Darkson Calamity as the history books tell it. The Darksons unlocked some secret property of Ragnite and tried to conquer the continent. A hundred cities raised its fell light, ten hundred thousand men and beast therewith. It says this area used to be one of the cities lost in that purge as well. So they did use Ragnite. It was in the middle of that destruction that the Valkyrer suddenly came into the picture. Supposedly they rose to face the Darksons, armed with sacred lances, blue with flame. So, so they, they beat them, and then, then history said that the people they beat were bad guys, man, with a twist. That became the War of the Valkyrer. <laughs> what a twist! <laughs> I had a picture book about that as a girl. But it's fiction, right? Like a fairy tale. Ruins like these dot the European map. Traces of the culture that once ruled the continent. The majority of the anthropological community now agrees that the Valkyrer did exist. Wow, this is so educational. <laughs> the Valkyrer won and rose to power while the Darksons were scattered across Europa. There are some who worship the Valkyrer as the saviors of Europa even today. Meanwhile, the Darksons got branded with the stigma of their past and were persecuted. With no land of their own, they had to work as itinerant laborers and ragnite miners. Which is why there are so many Darksons still working in the industrial sector today. I never knew that. Come to think of it, Isara's dad was an engineer, wasn't he? Anyway, that's enough history for today. Let's keep checking for Imperial tracks. Cool. Oh. I've been looking. But I still ain't seen nothing but sand. Those imps got some strange tastes if they're sunning themselves out here. What's got you, Rosie? Ain't like you to be so quiet. You got the runs or something. Oh, damn it, Lager. 
You're foul, Largo. And I'm just annoyed. More racism? Takes some kind of brass to blow up a chunk of turf this big, don't you? Looks like the dark hairs have been bad news for the rest of us folks since day one. Yeah. What do you mean by that? <laughs> what do you think I mean? No archaeological proof exists to support the theory that Darkson's destroyed Barius. Look around. How much more proof do you need? And it's an unfair generalization to assume that all Darksons cause trouble for others. Uh, I applaud your, um, your newfound self-confidence in arguing this point. But I do not believe Rosie wants to change her opinion. And unfortunately, unless someone wants to change their opinion, it isn't going to change. No matter how much you argue, like you discuss or explain or argue with them. <laughs> you saying you don't? Look, it's cause of you people that I, that my whole... Alright, time out you two. You stay out of this, Largo. Yeah, Largo. We're on patrol here. You keep squawking and we're likely to get sniped. <laughs> Yay, sniped! You too, kid. You know Rosie's got a temper on her. She wouldn't go off if you didn't talk back. Wow. Uh, I'm not gonna lie, Largo. My respect for you went down. Like, it was already pretty low when you were joining with her, but man. Woo! I don't believe anything I've said is untrue. <sighs> Stubborn as mules, both of you. <laughs> Fogio, what is that? It's called the Valkyrian Spiral. Okay, so what is it? I was talking about their power before, remember? The sacred blue flame? The spiral motif on their relief carvings are said to represent inexhaustible power. Oh, I didn't know that. Still, we haven't seen any Imperials here. Not even any signs of entry. I guess it's possible that this wasn't what brought the Empire out here. Well, the others are waiting. Let's go back. Sure, let's go. Huh? Ache! What in the... Alicia, what just happened? She unleashed her inner power. I don't know. I barely even touched it, and this door just opened. It looks like it keeps going. An underground chamber in the Barius ruins. This is a huge discovery. Should we go in? Do you have to ask? You just did. All right. Let's take a look. I think sometimes I'm clicking A so loud that the mic actually picks it up. <laughs> admittedly, admittedly, where my mic is, the controller is maybe a hand's length from the mic, so it does make sense. More story. What is this place? I was about to be like, whoa, magic, but then I realized he was just holding a torch. <laughs> it seems like it goes on forever. Don't fall. Wow, look at this wall. Amazing. There are engravings everywhere. What do they say, Faldio? I'm not sure. I wish I could tell you they're too ancient for me to decipher. What do you mean? It's cool and welcome to 
I don't know. I, I, I had something there for a second, and then as I went to say it, it just fucking appeared. Oh, well. Welcome. We're not alone. Is it the clowns? Well, how, how, how would they not be able to here? hear him? We don't get many visitors. I won't ask how you were able to break in. It's not really important. But you defile this sanctum with your presence. Kinky? Uh, guys. That's Maximilian. Maximilian? Wait. But he's the enemy commander. Emperor. Hold it right but... there. You yeah, shoot him right in the back. Just bang! I swear I will. What? Why would you not just shoot them? Uh, what? Lower your weapon. Your lives are worthless to me, but I do not wish to stain this sacred place with blood. Like, it's literally the enemy you commander. I would have just have this straight in the back of the head. Why don't we settle it outside? Welkin. Welkin. So, you're the brat who's responsible. My compliments for the vassal bridge and the base in Cloden. You quite impressed Compliment Jacob this, pants grab. singing your praises, boy. Silvario, come. Sir. Oh, now's I'm... our chance to take out their commander. Yeah, you She's could right, have done that before Let's asking go. them to surrender. You could have just... Uh, right. Oh, uh, oh, uh, a duel to the death at noon Let me catch you up with pistols. Situation. Uh, the enemy commander Maximilian is making for our base aboard a massive tank. Well, maybe we shouldn't have let him get into the fucking tank. It is imperative that you stop him before he reaches us. Your objective is the destruction of that giant tank. It is equipped with machine guns on both sides, so brace yourself for a merciless reception as you approach. Keep your distance when possible and use your tank and lances to take those machine guns out one by one. It also has large caliber cannons at both fore and aft ends that can't be destroyed. Their range is as you see here. They will fire at anything that stops in the area depicted. Keep your tank and troops clear of them if you want to live. Yay! Okay. Okay, I'm up. I'm up. I leaned right back in my chair. Uh, is this where I'm meant to be like, yeah, Largo, yeah, Nils, yeah, Walter, yeah, why not? I love that Nils likes no one. <laughs> <laughs> oh, actually, no. Uh, where's Walter? Walter, fuck off. Dean. Well, the guy. Um. It wasn't the cat, was it? He's such a butt. Look, look, that, I guess. I don't know. Uh, Rosie, you can go there. Uh, Alicia, you can go there. Susie, you can go there. I don't, I, I don't know. You'll commence combat now. Commence combat! That tank is our target. We have to stop it. Squad 7, move out! <laughs> now, dear galleons, flee. 